Everybody brought back out the Toot Scale Modeling is another spur review. Thought I'd look at something different. Something just a little unique that I stumbled across in my quest to buy every model on the planet. Tacum has made the CADS N1 Cashtan CIWS. Which I'm assuming is the anti-aircraft weapon system of one of the Russian battleships or destroyers or aircraft carriers. That's what it looks like. There's your sprue map. Kit number 2128. This is in 135th scale, so you would be able to use the other tack on 35th scale vehicles next to it if you were loading it or something. One, two, three, four sprues, a little bit of clear sprues, and a little bit of instructions. We'll open that at the end. Well, let's just pick a sprue and start. I guess this would appeal to usually seal the legs. Are they sealed? I think they're sealed. I guess this would appeal to we could appeal to both armor and naval guys. Because it is both. There's the base. Very good molding. And Tacum does do good molding, but this is really nice. I mean check out whatever these are here. I'm assuming they're side panels, the texture, and then this these holes are completely open on those two pieces. The base deck is nice and straight and it's going to be sturdy to hold it up. And you've got these finely detailed parts here, here, finely molded, good detail, ejector pin marks all out of place, I think it's a 2019 molding. Makes sense because I have had it for a little bit. That looks nice. And sprue V. This one is. Let's see what we have. Did I just miss it on that one? Oh, well, it's cut open now. I think it's mine. Looks like the plate where you turn and rotate the gun because it did say on the box elevate and traverse thinking this is part of the radar system and again the detail really nice really sharp crisp good plastic no ejector pins anywhere you'd want to see them. There's some back here. Hopefully that's covered. If not, then these will have to be filled underneath there. But, again, nice. Nice. There are two in here, and these are the rocket tubes. Yeah, I think I could open another bag for nothing. So these are two matching sprues, both D. Maybe that one was supposed to be A and it just looked like a V. So you may have seam lines to clean up when you put the rocket tubes together. But you'll be able to have them open. This part was bent down obviously to put in the bag. The caps to the rocket tubes. So. There you go. Here's this part, like I said, was bent over, so it'll fit in the bag. Some more delicate parts right there. Rocket tubes. Two of those. And last spring with some more delicate wiring looking parts on it or hoses. Again, these holes on all of this are open, so you don't have to drill them out. This looks like a missile, which is oddly put together, or not put together.
So imagine how big the whole ship would be if they gave you a 35th scale ship that this goes on to. Massive. And, and the instructions were the clear parts and the decals. So, looks like two Russian star decals. Looks like one clear piece. And one typical Tacom instruction book. CADS N1 Cash 10 CIWS Russian Navy. It's a shipborne air defense gun missile system designed for protection against anti ship missiles, anti radar missiles, cruise missiles, fixer rotary wing aircraft, as well as engagement of small sea and ground targets. Close in weapon system, CIWS, close in weapon system can be installed on ships displacing 400 plus tons. There you go. Y'all can pause it and read the rest. So, a little, you know, instructions, requirements, paint color call outs. There's your paint color call outs. Ammo by Meg paint color call outs. Sprue map, which was also on the box. And then you're starting with it looks like the main part that controls and holds the rockets. Move on to there. Move back over to here. Obviously I know nothing about Russian naval weaponry. Here's your rocket tubes. Be sure and check your seam lines. These parts here with the holes in them, put them together. Not sure what it's for. Could be a fire dampening system for when they launch the rockets. And there is it is, there's a missile right there. And it doesn't show it going anywhere except it's a missile. And there, really small, is a color call out. And there, you can read it, our colors. And then there's the two other Tacom kits. I do not have either one currently. That's it. There you have it. The close-in weapon system. Russian naval missile system. So, something a little different, a little fun. There's those parts with all the holes in it right there. Might be a fun little display build. Stick on yourself. Weathered up as I've been to sea for a while. Maybe one or two of the tubes have been fired. Could be cool. And actually that rocket that they have, have in here just dawned on me. Duh. They give you one rocket. She looks like you could have one of the tubes open and have this flying like halfway out the tube launching. Diorama possibilities. There you go. Thanks for watching. Sit your ass at the bench and build a model. This one looks to be simple. Could be a mojo builder or just something different. Thanks for watching.